Hi. In this quick demo I will show you how easy it is to show your eBay listings on your Facebook page using eBay Items Facebook app. At the top of the Facebook page search for eBay Items. Click search button. Now click on the eBay Items application. You should click a like button to see app status updates in your news feed section. Now click on go to app button at the top of the page. Before you continue, you should already have a Facebook fan page. If you don't have one, click to create your page now. It's easy, it's fast, and it's free. Once you have your Facebook fan page set up, come back to this page again and click on add to my page button. Here you should select your page where you want to see your eBay listings. Then click on Add eBay Items button. To increase the visibility of your eBay listings on your page, click Edit, then drag eBay Items app to the top of the list. Click Done. We are almost finished. Now click on the eBay Items tab to preview it. You must enter your eBay username that you used to sign into eBay. And finally click the Save button. You should see your eBay listings appear in a few seconds or less. If you do not see your listings, click on the red Change Settings button located at the top, then make sure you select your correct country and your username is correct. You can change the layout to a list view, or a thumbnail view. When you are done, click on Save Settings. By the way if you are not selling anything at the time, then you will not see your items in the list. Congratulations! Now you should direct your eBay customers to this page to show all of your listings. Enjoy the growth of your business on eBay and Facebook together. Wait, wait! I just want to show you one more cool thing you can do with eBay Items tab. Click to see the wall of your page. Then at the top of the page click on Edit Page. In the left menu click on Apps. Locate eBay Items app, then click on Edit Settings. Type in a custom tab title, such as My eBay Store. Click Save, then click OK. Now, when you go back to your page, you can see the new tab name. Thank you for watching this video. I know I was too fast to follow my steps, but you can rewind and watch it by sections and pause it while you repeat these steps.